Hey guys, Crispy Vids back with another unboxing. So today we've got the Apple TV 4K. Um, I've never had an Apple TV before. This is my um, first one. I always wanted to wait till I got the 4K one released. Um, and they took a long time to update from the Apple TV HD to the Apple TV 4K. So it was definitely worth the wait. Come with this new Siri remote and everything. So um, we'll just do a quick overview of what the new um, Apple TV 4K can do. So it's um, obviously high definition, um, full 4K high frame rate HDR for fluid crisp video. Um, this will pretty much work the same as the old one. Um, it's got the A12 Bionic chip. What else have we got here? We've got Dolby Vision, Dolby Atmos, um, the high frame rate HDR. We've got a new feature called balanced color with perfectly calibrated combo. So you can actually use your phone to calibrate your TV screen. So that's very handy. Um, and what, same as before, you've got all the Apple TV um, app. You've got all the um, software that you can load onto it, all the apps that you can download, Netflix, all the rest of it. Um, this is the new Siri remote. So very handy. Um, Apple TV Plus, obviously. Um, it does Apple Fitness, so you can get your Apple Fitness on the screen and your watch syncs and everything like that. Obviously, Apple Music and Apple Arcade, which looks like a bit of fun on the, on the big screen. Um, you've got SharePlay. Uh, what else have we got down here? You can share two sets of AirPods to it. You can also pair two HomePod minis uh, to create stereo um, speakers for the Apple TV. You've got full iPhone control with the app and HomeKit, AirPlay, all the usual Apple stuff. So let's have a look at this. With the model I got was the um, Apple TV 4K HDR 64 gig. I just got the biggest because I was just worried about putting a few apps and stuff on and filling it up and not having enough room to do that sort of stuff. So I got the bigger one. Now, um, one thing that I will note is um, you do need a specific cable to run this. It says it on the Apple website that you need a ultra high speed HDMI cable to be able to run the 4K with the HDR and Dolby Vision. So just keep that in mind when you purchase this. And also on some TVs, um, just to let you know that only certain HDMI ports will allow you to connect the HDR and Dolby Vision. So just look up the manual for your TV to make sure that it's um, HDMI 1, 2, 3 or 4 or however many you got. Because I do know that the LG... I think it's PU8000 TVs. They only do that on ports three and four. So just bear that in mind. Okay, let's get this out. And in here we've got the Apple TV box. It's quite small really. I haven't really seen one in person before. So you've got a little pull tab there, one off here. There we go. We've got the nice shiny Apple TV surface. Very satisfying. And you've, it's very simple guys. You've got your power, HDMI and ethernet. Now you don't have to use ethernet. You can use um, your wireless. So you can use Wi-Fi. Uh, let's get the remote out. Now this is the brand new um, Siri remote. So you can purchase this separately. If you've got an older Apple TV, you can purchase this and sync it up to the older Apple TV as well. So it's, um, all made out of aluminium now. It's very nice, very nice feel, nice weight to it. And um, you've got the lightning port to charge it. Apparently it lasts quite a long time on one charge, so that's good. Let's see what we got in here. I've got just the old regulatory information, I guess, just there. Couple of Apple TV stickers, Apple stickers, sorry. 
Um, we've got a little quick start guide there and underneath we've got the USB to lightning port cable for charging the remote and just down this side in this fancy little packaging we've got the power cable so you can see there it's just a figure eight power cable pretty standard very nice flexible cable um, the only thing it doesn't include is a HDMI so you need to provide your own HDMI cable to run the Apple TV so there you go guys there's the Apple TV 4k unboxed in 64 gig hope you enjoyed the video thanks for watching cheers